Dead Reckoning is a novel by Charlene Harris, published in 2011. It is the 11th book in the Suki Stackhouse series, which follows the life of Suki Stackhouse, a telepathic waitress who gets caught up in the supernatural world of vampires, werewolves, and other creatures. The novel starts with Suki attending a meeting with the Vampire King of Nevada, Felipe de Castro, who is interested in acquiring the territory of Louisiana. During the meeting, Suki realizes that Felipe has a hidden agenda and suspects that he may have been involved in the disappearance of her vampire boyfriend, Eric Northman's maker, Appius Levius Osella. Suki's suspicions are confirmed when she learns that Osella has been killed and Felipe is the prime suspect. As Suki tries to uncover the truth behind Osella's death, she also has to deal with her complicated love life. Eric and Suki are in a committed relationship, but their happiness is threatened by the return of Suki's former lover, Bill Compton, who has been transformed into a vampire god. Suki is also torn between her feelings for Alcide Ervo, a werewolf who is also interested in her, and her loyalty to Eric. Throughout the novel, Harris explores themes of love, loyalty, betrayal, and power. The characters are complex and multidimensional, each with their own motivations and agendas. Suki, in particular, is a strong and independent woman who is not afraid to speak her mind and stand up for herself. She is also fiercely loyal to her friends and lovers and will do whatever it takes to protect them. Harris also explores the idea of power and the corrupting influence it can have on individuals. Felipe de Castro is a prime example of this, as he is willing to do whatever it takes to acquire more power and control. He is manipulative and cunning and he uses his position as a vampire king to his advantage. In contrast, Eric Northman, despite being a powerful vampire, is also shown to have a vulnerable side. He genuinely cares for Suki and is willing to make sacrifices for her. The novel also explores the concept of mortality and the fear of death. Suki as a human, is acutely aware of her own mortality and the fragility of life. Her relationships with Eric and Bill, both vampires who are immortal, highlight the contrast between the finite nature of human life and the infinite existence of vampires. Harris's writing style is engaging and fast-paced, with plenty of action and suspense to keep readers on the edge of their seats. She also incorporates humor into the story, which adds a light-hearted element to the otherwise dark and intense plot. The dialogue between the characters is sharp and witty, and their interactions are a highlight of the novel. In conclusion, Dead Reckoning is a compelling novel that explores complex themes of love, loyalty, power, and mortality. Charlene Harris has created a rich and detailed world filled with supernatural creatures and characters that readers will care about. The novel is well-written and engaging, with plenty of twists and turns to keep readers guessing until the very end. It is a must-read for fans of the Suki Stackhouse series and anyone who enjoys supernatural fiction.